Oh, Bubba, look at you. You look like a big piece of candy floss. No way, hot cross bun ice cream. We, sh we shouldn't get that, Joe, no. We can't get that. We got the hot cross bun ice cream. I'm not just a pretty girl. Happy Sunday everyone, I hope you're having the most amazing day today. So, today is Saturday, so this happened yesterday for you guys, but I am going to break my Aldi and Lidl virginity for the very first time. I mean, I have gone into a Lidl and Aldi before, especially when I was younger, but I've never ever ever done a shop. So Joe and I are gonna head off to our local Aldi and Lidl. They opened up a brand new one, not too far. I think that's probably one of the reasons why I haven't really gone to Lidl and Aldi's because there wasn't one very close, but there is now. If you like this video, please give it a massive thumbs up and also hit the subscribe button and turn on the notifications so you don't ever miss another video. Goodbye, Millie Mopsies. You're gonna have a bath later, so we'll bath you when we get home. We also need to buy Milo's birthday cake because it's his birthday next week. So I kind of want to get him a cake. Drop a comment down below. What kind of cake do you think Milo would like? Milo, you didn't eat your cereal this morning. Milo, did you not like the golden nuggets? They're not golden nuggets, mum. They're multigrain balls. Yeah, they're multigrain balls. They're the cheaper version. You got a picky pig. Is it because they weren't golden nuggets? Probably. He's really fussy. In a bit, Mills. So Joe bought this massive penis looking self-defense thingy majig. I did a little poll on Instagram and guess what they want us to call him? What do they want to call him? Norris. Norris. Oh, yeah. Chuck Norris. Norris won. Yeah. So. So, Chuck Norris all about so, oh gosh, we need to put some more sand in him. So Joe has a brand new YouTube channel called Fight Perfect TV. And it's a self-defense channel. So if you want to know any self-defense, fight perfect TV, link in the description. Okay, we found some random bits of Vaseline. And where's it coming from? Uh, I think you put your charger lead in your bag and it <laughs> dipped into something very soft and squidgy and then you put it into the USB. Do you think port? that's what happened? Yeah. I like to deny all knowledge. Mm-hmm, you plead the fifth on that one, yeah? <laughs> yeah. Here she is, ladies and gents. We're sticking to Lidl first. Sticking to Lidl? We're going to Lidl. It's massive. It's quite a big one. That's what she said. Oh, Joe. <laughs> yeah, this uh, car park's great for crap drivers because how big is this road? It's like six lanes. This is yeah. Like motorway <laughs> this is motorway worthy. Okay, first thing I spotted, gardening stuff is available just outside. Lots of lovely plants. As you guys know, I really love my plants. Quite affordable, $2.99. Two for fiver. Quite like the little pots as well. It's nice to see spring flowers. It makes them really chirpy. Just get in my trolley. <laughs> oh my god, how extra is this? There's a bakery as soon as we walk in with lots of fresh, smelling croissants. Oh my this gosh, this is very sneaky. Yeah. <laughs> It's made me feel really hungry. Oh, these look delish, don't they? 49p, that's really naughty. These are the winner for me. I absolutely love a good pan of chocolate. Toffee fill, yum yum. It's never ending. There's even another bit here. Avocado. The avocado lovers. One of these in Sainsbury's and Tesco. I think, I think it's like £1.75 a pack of two. Is that right? For a small one, but for a large one, it's about... Oh, that's really large. I do need some mints. If you see any mints, yeah. Gonna film a lovely Instagram video for these guys. Apples for Milo? Yeah, he needs his apples. Don't forget, we need to get a birthday cake. We've also got pick of the week. And what have they got in here then? Haddock goujons. It's no chicken goujon, is it? Chicken kebabs, oh, I love a good chicken kebab. Got barbecue ones there. Do you know what? I thought Lidl was a good place to get sweets because that's what I used to get when I was younger just packets of sweets and biscuits German biscuits are always good oh should we have steak night tonight steak night. with some like blue cheese sauce I haven't eaten like a steak in a while shall we yeah let's treat ourselves Joe let's have a fillet find the biggest one 
get more for our money. Beautiful block of stilton. Oh, they got a trampoline in here. I would absolutely love a trampoline. 19, no, sorry, 99.99. That is pretty good. What size is it? Uh, eight foot. That's a pretty decent size. Yeah, we can't have one of those, can we? We tried it once and it was way too big. Also got barbecue items. So we've got this Toronto Click Charcoal Barbecue. 79.99. What's this one? This is Outdoor Swing Barbecue. 29.99. So again, got lots of barbecue equipment. I think this is, what's this? Tablecloths. Oh, this is a good little thing. It's a Raclette grill 14.99 that is a bargain that would be amazing at grilling halloumi three in one herb pots these are 2.99 each we do also have chairs and tables a garden storage box i feel like we need that it's 24.99 that is oh we got like little fire pits we're gonna get one but i think we're gonna get it in bnm and i think we're gonna go to bnm aren't we joe i can show you the fire pits because they're pretty epic in there Oh, the waterfalls, that's the range. I like the one in the range. We're gonna have to hold out for the guys because we still need to decorate our garden. So that video is coming soon. I really love the random shoes in Lidl. <laughs> I just love this. It reminds me of being like in Spain or a foreign country for some reason. Oh, it's a European shop, isn't it? Oh, uh, that'll be why then. Got lawnmowers here. So the lawnmowers are 139 pounds. Bluetooth selfie stick is 9.99 oh my god 69.99 for gopro ripoff what do you think you're the cameraman that's not bad is it for those of you who are planning to go camping over the holidays they do have tents in here uh so a double roof tent 34.99 and the sleeping bag is 14.99 i think 14.99 for a sleeping bag is not bad they could see me in a tent. I could do camping. I'm gonna do 24 hours in a sleeping bag just to prove you wrong. Oh, naughty cream egg. Oh, Joe. No. I think we bought this once and we ate it within like an hour. <laughs> You're on a diet. Well, I'm not. Okay, for me, this is so little. Oh my gosh. Wafer rolls. Has these ones got chocolate in it? They do. They've also got milk chocolate ones as well i'm gonna get that for me a lovely lady just said that i need to check out the hot cross bun ice cream where is it oh my gosh is it here oh my good goodness it exists no way hot cross bun ice cream i'm intrigued now joe should we get it with the wafers Yoink. yep have we got wait is it different flavors you've got lemon rang as well no, hot cross bun. Yeah, hot cross bun wins it. Oh, look at these fabulous desserts. These are definitely much better than the likes of Sainsbury's and Tesco. That's just my opinion. Like, look at that. Triple chocolate roulade. Got a load of cupcakes here. How much is that? Is it the Easter ones? Oh, they look good, don't they? Hidden centers. We, sh we shouldn't get that, Joe. No, we can't get that. We got the hot cross bun ice cream. No, we we're gonna, no, 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 we can't. Joe, no, we're on diets. Well, I'm, I'm not, you are, but <laughs> I'm trying to be good with my food. This is really pretty. A very pretty design kettle. Either $17.99 or $19.99. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe CN is a European brand. Every time I go on holiday, I see these kind of products. So I just associate it with <gasps> knockoff Batiste. Let's get one of those. One pound, that's cheaper. That's one. That's much cheaper, £1.29. Yeah, let's get, um, what's, sweet pink? Yeah. yeah, let's get a sweet pink one. I'm gonna give that a go. But it's the shower gels that reminds me of holiday because my mum used to get them when we used to run out. Oh, we've also got, um, this is a knockoff of, oh my God, why have I got a mind blank? I'm gonna put the logo. It's gonna annoy me when I edit this video because I do know the name. It's titled as Australian Conditioner. Australian Conditioner, oh my gosh. That is literally identical. Maybe I'd actually start cooking if I just had pink cooking utensils, do you think? Really? <laughs> I made a lasagna last week. How long are you gonna use? I made a lasagna. Oh, that lasagna took me three hours to make, so I have a good few weeks left. Okay, we're down the Isle of Dreams. Yes. Complete rip off Kinder Bueno. Belgian chocolates, 129. These are my favourite 
ever. I swear every single shop has a version of these. Oh, Crave is just, oh, there, there's nothing like Crave in my opinion. We found some cakes, they're 3.99. I reckon Milo will quite like this. Obviously we're not gonna feed them the whole lot. He probably would eat the whole lot, but that yeah, wouldn't so be good for him. Oh, he would destroy that, wouldn't he? Sub 16, but one Milo fit in that would be. One Milo fit in, one like Milo sitting. I can't talk today, I'm sorry. Found my mint. Joe's really impressed that's only 25p for a bottle of water. Amazing. Oh, we've just spotted they do Lidl charging as well. I have no idea why we haven't shopped in Lidl or Aldi. Well, I can't really vouch for Aldi right now, but Lidl. I really enjoyed that. Good. Did you? Because you don't go shopping enough. <laughs> to be fair, Joe does the shopping. And because, I mean, Lidl or Aldi aren't on our doorstep, that's probably why. But I'd, I'd happily do a trip once a month, you know? Maybe that this could be a thing. This could be a thing. Aldi and Lidl shopping trip every single month. Drop me a comment down below if you'd like that idea. So I think we're going to head to Aldi now. And then we're going to treat you guys with a bit of a B&M shop. Because we do need to um, pick a number of things out. So catch you in a bit. Here we go, Aldi. Yes, Aldi. Ready, Joey? Yeah, here we go again. Here we go again. Okay, Aldi do do a range of plants. This makes me so excited because I do really need to get some plants for the garden. So let me know if you want to see an Aldi video shopping for that. But we're heading in now. Yeah, Joe just said it's much more controlled than Lidl, which I completely agree. There isn't a bakery right by the door. Uh, let's shop. <laughs> you got hungry in there, didn't you? Water is also 25p in here. Okay, so we need to get tonight's veg with the steak we bought in Lidl. So I'm thinking some broccoli. Some corn on the cob. Joe, I really like the layout of this shop a lot. It's definitely more conventional and it's very organized in here. Okay, what's the test verdict? Same price? Five, 65p. Is that cheaper? It's cheaper. It's cheaper for Millie Mop's apples. But we already bought some for him. <laughs> I love some crisps. So 75p for pack of six ready salted. That is very cheap. Joe and I absolutely love pom bears, um, but they have teddy faces, which is a rip off and it's 99p, very affordable. Oh, we got a little roast dinner here. Oh my gosh, that looks pretty good. I always judge a roast by the Yorkshire pudding and that is a good Yorkshire pudding. £2.29. Okay, apparently these candles are absolutely amazing. They look like Jo Malone and a lot of people have said that they smell just like Jo Malone so I'm very excited to give this a go. I just love the packaging. It just looks amazing. Yeah, we're definitely gonna get one of those. So sorry that was cut short. We were actually told that we couldn't film in there, which is fine. Uh, so we're gonna head to BNM now. And get told we're not to film in there? <laughs> no, I've filmed in there before. Uh, so we're gonna pick up some things from BNM, and it's literally just up the road so we haven't got too far to travel but we did buy a bunch of things from Audi so I will do a haul as soon as we get home. Joey has found exactly what he needs. I bought one of these in my last video I'll put the link down in the description and by the way these are just amazing they're so cheap in here $4.99 yeah I think pick up this one for at home. I really want to show you the fire pits Let's go see the fire pits. So Joey, this is all the fire pits. And I know how much you love a fire pit, so I thought I would leave you to choose which one. I personally really love this one, but I think this one's more of a fire pit though and that one. No, I think that would be a bit too big. I think this one's my favorite because it does have a slight copper texture to it. I really like that one. I think, I don't know about this one, you know? I think that one. Water features, so £100 for this one, but there is one in the range that I absolutely love. So we're gonna have to go shop into the range at some point. I mean, I do like it. So I did cover everything which is new in BNM in my recent video, so please check it out down in the description. I check everything out, like all this garden stuff and just basically everything new in. So yeah, link down in the description. We've just got home and we thought we'd give little mini mops a bath. Someone's been rolling in mud, haven't they? 
Oh, there's a big shade. Did he just cover you? I think he needs a bigger paddling pool this year. Oh, Bubba, look at you. You look like a big piece of candy floss. Oh, baby. Good boy, Milo. Okay, I'm going to do a bit of a haul for you guys. I've got two bags, one full of Audi stuff and the other little. So we did basically get things that we just needed, but I'm going to show you. So from Audi first, we managed to get a carrot cake for Milo. Uh, we went carrot because um, he really likes carrot. And this one's quite small. Um, I don't want him eating too much cake because that would not be good. But that's for his little birthday thing I'm gonna do for him. We got some bananas. Corn the cob to go with the steak we got from Lidl. And some broccoli. Oh, we got this from BNM, which was the Ambi Puri, or Ambi Pure, sorry. These are amazing, by the way. They come in packs of two and they just make the room smell amazing. And I also got a candle. I have been meaning to try this candle for such a long time. I spoke to someone the other day and they said that it smells just like Jo Malone, but it, does, it doesn't last as long as Jo Malone, if that makes sense, but it is really good. So I got number three, which is pomegranate. I just love how similar it looks to Jo Malone. So from Lidl, I think we've got more stuff in Lidl. But we got the chocolate wafers. That's to go with the ice cream we bought, which was the hot cross bun. So excited to give this a go. A lady legit came running after me and was like, if you're vlogging, you need to try the hot cross bun ice cream. So had to get that. We got some eggs, um, steak. Gonna have that for dinner. I don't really eat meat really but that just looked too good uh, not to have so I think we're gonna have uh, steak and blue cheese tonight some mint for an Instagram video that I'm gonna be recording this week so follow my Instagram if you haven't already apple smilo some blue cheese and CN dry shampoo I am so intrigued to give this a go does it smell like Batiste Oh, that smells really candy-like. Oh, smells a bit like air freshener. There we go, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please drop me a comment down below if you want me to do this kind of video again in the future. I really enjoyed it. I love going shopping. I love taking you guys with me. So drop your comment and tell me what kind of shopping video you want me to do next. I did go to the biggest Primark in the world. You have to check it out. If there's one video you need to check out on my channel, it's that one because the Primark is just, oh my god, out of this world. I'll leave that link down in the description, so yeah, you have another video to watch after this one. Also subscribe if you're new and turn on the notifications so you never miss a video. But as always guys, make sure that you link, like and subscribe and I'll see you next time for another video. Bye!